<laughs> First aid kit. <laughs> uh, anyone? It's fine, thank you. Because there's like. I don't know why I'm laughing because look at my heel. Good afternoon, guys, and welcome to today's video. So, I'm actually going to put these back on. <laughs> So I was in London a few weeks ago as you may or may not know if you follow me on Instagram and I decided to just like vlog food. I thought I'm just going to vlog all the food that I eat and do a kind of like what to eat in London, what not to eat in London because trust me there were some mistakes made on the food front. So welcome to today's video. It's just going to be me taking you through, I think it's two days worth of food, maybe three but I think it's two. Um, just all different food spots in, in London, all vegan just to show you what you can have, where to go, and one or two places not to go. So two of the nights we actually went out, um, we never went out for dinner to like a restaurant, we were out at like an event or we were at like a cinema, something like that. So we just got food there. So the dinner food, I would say we kind of disappointed ourselves on that front, but breakfast, lunches, snacks, ice creams, all that kind of stuff. Check out the vlog. If you're ever in London, if you live in London, if you're going to London, check out these places. Um, I do want to say that one thing that really helped us was the Vegan Friendly UK app. So that is an app that you can download. They have an Instagram page. I followed them on Instagram for so long. They show you all the kind of tips and tricks around the UK and other places as well. Um, but their Vegan Friendly UK page is obviously all the UK fo focused stuff. Um, and they have an app that basically tells you restaurants that are not just vegan friendly because I think they have to have a vegan starter main and dessert, something like that, to be like clarified as vegan friendly it's vegan friendly so vegan friendly UK app helped us so much with like finding places to go and even just their Instagram so just having a look on their Instagram page and seeing what kind of things they were posting about um, really helped to see what food was about in London so definitely check out their Instagram page um, and their app if you are visiting London bites because it's 30 degrees and um, I don't do 30 degrees it's very warm for me and um, so we're cycling now from Notting Hill to where we've booked for lunch which is called Holy Carrot this was recommended by uh, Nutty Foodie Fitness Steph Joshi she said that it has the best vegan food she's ever had in her life and she's not even vegan so that's where we're going cable cycle for 15 minutes through a park that's the plan <laughs>
went to that place called Stefano's for breakfast. I'm just filming them in <laughs> um, for breakfast. And so basically, it's an all vegetarian place. And we'd seen it on Instagram um, and seen loads of people going to it on Instagram. And their menu has like vegan French toast and all this kind of stuff. And they brought over the French toast and it wasn't vegan, it had cream all over it. And we'd asked them like specifically, like, because she'd asked, Do you want cream and other toppings? And we said, Is it vegan cream? She says, No. I says, Well, why would you put non vegan cream on vegan French toast? Anyway, they ended up bringing it over with cream on it, clotted cream and all the works. Um, so we asked them, like, cool, can we get the vegan version? That's what we've asked for. Um, and the, so you can kind of see the kitchen, like it's open. And the, the two chefs, they were just like talking back and forth, is this vegan, is this vegan, is this vegan? So we essentially had to tell them what was vegan, which you don't want to do. So I don't recommend um, it for a vegan place, which is annoying because there's so many good, um, places for like vegan breakfast and stuff in London and um, but that one just looked really good obviously on Instagram and that kind of thing this is the problem with social media um but yeah they have vegan French toast and they don't even actually know what's vegan so don't recommend <laughs>